A skeleton of an 18 meter long dragon has been found in China. Residents of a Chinese city have stumbled upon the remains of a mysterious creature that measures a staggering 18 meters in length and resembles the legendary dragon of Asian mythology. The skeleton of a dragon has been discovered by residents of a Chinese city who claim that the strange skeleton is proof that the mythical creature exists, or at least existed. The skeleton is around 18 meters long, has two small arms that protrude in the center and a head that suspiciously resembles the skull of a cow. Do I smell forgery? The dragon was found in a field in the city of Zhangjiak, in the Hebei province. In northern China. Images taken by several witnesses on the scene show dozens of villages surrounding the skeleton of the alleged dragon. Some people in shock, and not sure what to do with the remains they came across, but we can clearly see from the video footage that many of the bystanders seemed convinced that they were looking at the skeleton of a real mythical creature. Unlike dragons depicted in Western mythology, traditional Chinese dragons do not have wings, as they fly by swimming in the air with movements similar to those of a snake sliding on the ground. According to the mythological accounts of various ancient Asian cultures, the Chinese dragon is a mythological and legendary animal of China and other Asian cultures that has parts of nine animals, lobster eyes, deer horns, camel's nose, dog nose. Catfish moustaches, lion's mane, snake, fish scales, and eagle claws. The dragon is also the personification of the concept of yang, masculine, and is related to time as a keeper of rain and water in general. An alternative view, promoted by Hicks Sin, is that the first dragons represented a kind of crocodile. Specifically, crocodilus porosus. An ancient giant crocodile, known for its ability to accurately sense changes in air pressure, thus anticipating the arrival of rain. This may have been the origin of the dragon's mythical attributes of controlling time, especially rain. In addition, there is evidence of crocodile worship in the ancient Babylonian, Indian, and Mayan civilizations. The creature was around 18 meters long. From its origins as a totem or stylized representation of natural creatures, the Chinese dragon evolved to become a mythical animal. For the Han Dynasty the appearance of the dragon was described as being with the trunk of a snake, the scales of a cup, the tail of a whale, deer horns, the face of a camel, the claws of an eagle, the ears of a bull, the feet of a tiger and the eyes of a lobster besides having a flaming pearl under its chin. Chinese dragons are occasionally depicted with bat wings that grow from their front, but most of them lack them, although they are still capable of flying. In modern times, the belief in the dragon seems to be sporadic at most. There seem to be very few who see the dragon as a real creature. The cult of the Dragon Kings as rulers of water and time persists in many regions and is deeply rooted in Chinese cultural traditions, such as Chinese New Year celebrations. <laughs>